Hi, this is uh, Jennifer. Jennifer came to us uh, last week, I think, in Navan, and she has quite an interesting story for you guys. So the spotlight is on you. <laughs> Lovely. Um, I came to see Matthew in Navan last Sunday, and Grace, and to be honest, I'm still in shock today. I've had uh, chronic pain disease, like fibromyalgia for the last eight years. I've been in and out of doctors, consultants, private, public. Um, I'm nearly a year at the moment waiting on IV ketamine infusion, um, which wouldn't be ideal. I'm naive to take medications, I have too bad of a reaction. I've gone to bed at night and just thought I wouldn't get up in the morning, thought I was going to die. And I have to say, last week in Navan, getting the places mixed up now. Um, I'm back here today in Racket Hall. Um, I've had no pain whatsoever. And I don't know how or what Matthew has done, but it's the longest ever that I've been pain free, Matthew. In how many years? Eight. In eight years? I haven't been able to go outside. It has caused me very bad depression, like severe anxieties. So I've done courses for anxiety, you name it, and I didn't want to be alive. I didn't want to be alive. And because you were feeling so, I was feeling so down and so bad. So bad, so bad. I'm, okay. I'm one of them people I paint my own house and everything, and I haven't even been able to clean, only for my friend and my son. I, I don't really think I'd been gone a long time ago, even if it was in not the right way. Okay, well, we're glad that you're here. And you told me earlier that your son uh, comes in here every morning and asks you, how are you, for the yeah. last week, is that right? Yeah, because I'm trying to persuade him to come with horrific psoriasis and okay. the arthritis of psoriasis. Okay, and you mentioned there earlier that you couldn't even put on your shoes. No, I stay in my pyjamas most of the time. There's a lot of shoes I can't wear. I have to throw them all out. Right. Well, we've just done your feet there a few minutes ago when you took off your I took uh, off boots the shoes. and shoes. <laughs> uh, and that's great to see. And I actually got into a bath last Sunday when I got home from being with you. Yeah. And it's the first time in a very long time <coughs> that the water actually hasn't burned through my skin. It felt like it was burning. It's that bad. The symptoms of fibromyalgia, I don't think people realise how, how bad they how can be. How intense it can be. Yeah, and not only pain, sick feeling all the time. Nausea. I was nausea for five weeks constant before I came to you. And okay. I might and have had a break before that and would have been back. And, and how is it now? Gone, since I left you last week. Well, gone. I think that's a success story, uh, folks. What do you think is out? highly recommend in my opinion and I'm not one of these I would be always a little bit skeptical of things don't judge what you don't know and give it a go that's my opinion I recommend Matthew and Grace very much well I think uh, everyone is a skeptic and anyone that isn't is a fool but at least try it. <laughs> exactly. You've nothing to lose but try Well, I certainly had nothing to lose but everything to gain. Okay, well, we're delighted with your progress. Thank you, Tom. Long may it last for me. Thank you, Tom. God bless.